Do I have an arrow in my butt? Oh my god, how embarrassing. <laughs> already go check out my new merch store link will be in the description hello everyone and welcome to the very first episode of my brand new series on my channel a brand new smp called harmony hollow and a lot of you guys already guessed this on my twitter you little sneaky geniuses this server has a lot of members i'm gonna list all of them in the description go check out their channels show them some love and yeah this this server is very whimsical and so cute you guys are gonna love it so this this is actually season three of Harmony Hollow. Uh, this is my very first time being in it, so I'm very, very excited. And uh, I have a very sad story to tell you. Uh, cue the cue the emo music. Um, I actually recorded two hours of footage. Do you know how much two hours of footage is? Oh, that's a lot of footage. And my power went out, so poof goes the footage. It's gone. It just left me, just like that. So. Now, I have to show you all the things that I've done, which I mean, really, granted, isn't a lot, but, uh, yeah, now I don't get to show you from the start, but I'm gonna do it again anyways, because that's, you know, it's just how it goes. So, here we are in Harmony Hollow. This is the spawn. I was, well, I'm in a bush now. Here is the magnificent purple tree of justice right here at spawn with the pretty lanterns and the pretty glass and all the pretty vines that we all love to death. Uh, this is, this is like the main tree. I've seen it in a lot of photos and a lot of videos, but here I am looking at it in the flesh. So everyone here has a little hut and this is the starter kit, which, uh, which I already got cause I've already started. Like I said, traumatic music playing. We, we, we lost all the footage, but basically in my starter kit, I got five pieces of bread, a wooden sword, a wooden pickaxe, and a wallet. And uh, I'm gonna show the wallet. We have we have currency. Look at that, dollar bills. Basically, just things I need to survive. And here is the important info room. If I can get in with all the heads of everybody except for me, because I just joined, which is <laughs> real sad. I'm I'm not offended or anything. <laughs> Fine. This is where we can set the time of day or the, clear the weather. Usually we do that if we're not recording, so it just makes things a little bit easier for us. Um, on top of the- oh my god, this is terrifying. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you, I thought this was a statue. This is a player! Oh my god, uh, this mask. I don't like it. I'm, I'm just gonna run away. So uh, everybody has a hut, and mine is this way. I haven't marked on the map, but I have literally no sense of direction. So, oh, yep, here it is. I got the pink roof. Fixella's hut. And if I, if I could fit in my, I've gained a little weight. There's not much in here. I, like I said, I haven't really accomplished that much. I just found a place to live, which I can show you. But in my chest, I have junk beyond junk beyond junk. And I have, I mean, I collected a few things that I, I like, like some cacti and uh, some sugar cane. You know, I got, I got some goods in there. I got some goods. I can actually replenish my, my junk. Put some more stuff in there. It's very empty. And there is a community inn where everyone can go sleep if it is nighttime, like right now. Where is this freaking thing? It's I thought it was close to me. Yikes. Uh, I don't know where it is. Oh no. Well, either way, here's the important info. We'll just set the time today because I'm having a conversation with you guys. All right, so I guess I'm going to head off and show you guys where my house is. I need my handy dandy boat. You guys don't even know the amount of cuteness that's in this freaking mod pack, guys. I mean, it is kind of crazy. Uh, I, I don't think I even went the right way. Oh wait, I might have. Okay, these dogs, sadly, are really, really mean, which makes me want to cry. Because, I mean, look how freaking cute they are. I don't want to kill it. I don't want to. Got revenge on the wild dog. He killed me earlier. See my death point? <laughs> Tell me that's not the saddest thing you've ever seen. Yeah, seriously, it was so sad. The rain came down on me. I have no sense of direction. I don't know where the hell I'm going. <gasps> wow, is it a chicken? <gasps> Somebody's boat got left behind. That's actually really sad and also scary. There are sometimes these thunderstorms on here where I it literally gets so dark, there is not even a chance of being able to see. <gasps> We're almost there. Do you see all the flowers? We have arrived. I'm gonna just dock my boat right there. And by docking my boat, I mean I'm gonna take it with me. 
So I live, oh well, if I could get through here. My little hut that I've set up is right there. It, it's literally unfinished. It's a, uh, I didn't have enough, didn't have enough blocks. Nice. Uh, so this is my future home. It is in this beautiful tulip land. And I mean, it is, it is really magical. So there's this really cool thing you can do. Are you guys ready for this? Um, we can dye wood, which is like revolutionary to me. I've never seen this before. So, oh, I don't have any dye. Well, here's a white tulip with some light gray dye. How exciting. So uh, we could just put some wood all around here. Like you're gonna make a chest and you stick some dye in the middle and voila, you've got some dyed wood. Like, um, that's honestly incredible. Like that was so easy. I mean, look how many freaking flowers are around me. It's not like I couldn't find dye. Okay. <laughs> of course, I don't want to like chop down all the flowers because they're so pretty. I don't want to do that. So like, I guess just like where my house is built, I can chop them down or I could go around and find some more flowers. I mean, it's not like it's hard, but you know, still, this is just really convenient. I don't even know where to begin. Do I have an arrow in my butt? Oh my God. How embarrassing. Oh, I forgot to mention our little huts in the beginning at spawn over there. Those will later turn into shops, I think. How cool is that? That's pretty cool. So I definitely think I, I need some more wood. Um, I need to kind of uh, figure out what's going on over here. It's gonna take me a long time to build. This is full survival mode, you guys. So that is time consuming. So I'm just gonna take some flowers from right here. I know, I know. What a demon, I know, she, I know, don't have to tell me, okay? But like, how many planks do, oh, well, I guess I should have, I should have made the die first. Oh God, okay, so how many planks does this make? Eight, right, the amount that's on there. Okay, Sasha, good job, you're smart. You're using your smarticles. So there's 24, and I ran out. Well, that's sad. If I want to, I can actually start reconstructing my little square into a better square. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna build yet. That's the thing is, you guys gotta leave me some suggestions. Like, what kind of house should I build? Should it be a normal, oh, what am I doing? Uh, should I have a normal looking house? Or should I have something crazy? Or what? What do you guys think I should do, huh? What, do you, what should I do? Also, I think we have backpacks in this mod pack, which y'all know I need to get one of those because I am a hoarder. There goes my beautiful sign. Well, rest in peace sign. I'm really curious to see what the different colored woods would look like. Let's just look for planks. I think the white ones look nice. I love the cyan ones so much. And the lime ones, oh snap. We are definitely getting some lime ones because those look like mint green and I am all about my mint green. For sure, for sure, yeah, for sure. I just went ahead and turned off my shaders because I couldn't see a damn thing. And now the rain stopped, like really? Oh no, it's because I'm under a tree, ha, huh, hilarious. So I don't know how to get like these pretty colorful trees. They're really pretty. Oh, maple saplings. Now I got it. Isn't this adorable? The tulip land biome has these like pre-made paths like all throughout it, which is so, so nice and so cute. It just makes it look so well put together. I feel so fancy. But I definitely think um, we could use some trees because all it is is just a bunch of tulips, which, you know, don't get me wrong, that's great. But I definitely need some trees around. What kind of trees though? That is the true question. So I got some more dye along the way and a bunch of wood, like a bunch of wood. Right now I'm just making this like stripey mess. I, I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. It's not gonna stay like this, but like just for now. I probably shouldn't even be putting this much work into it because I'm just gonna tear it down. Oh, what is that? Nice, we have a rectangle. Aw, it doesn't make the colored doors if I use the different colored wood. That's sad. Let's figure out how to make a backpack because that is what we need. Oh, I think actually they're being a little glitchy or something right now. I don't want to mess it up. So I guess we're gonna have to wait on that, which is kind of a shame because I definitely need one. My friends, it looks like we need to go mining. Okay, I think I may have found a cave. I'm going to harvest all of this, all of this coal, because I, uh, I have like none. I think I've used every last bit of it. Oh God, it's really spooky. Hey, more coal. Oh, is that iron? Yes. Okay, down into Spookyville. Does this even go anywhere? Oh, maybe. I'm gonna take all the coal I can get. Oh <gasps> yeah, this is why you take all the coal you can get because you find more iron. I just hit the jackpot. Rock formation? Oh, 
Uh, I, well, I broke it. I broke it. Is this a dead end? No, I'm probably just gonna dig down from in here cause like I'm in a pretty good spot right now. Okay, now that my pickaxe and my ax are both finally broken, I am going to get some more sticks. I need a backpack so bad. Turns out they actually do work. You just can't click items into the backpack. You have to just physically drag it. There's like a glitch, I don't know. I thought they were broken. Clearly they're not. But I am gonna go ahead and make a furnace and start getting this uh, this iron going. We can make a pickaxe, upgrading. And I'm probably gonna go ahead and just upgrade my sword. I feel like I'm gonna need it. Go ahead and make a new ax since mine broke. What do we need for a backpack? We need oak chest and a bunch of leather. Unfortunately, we have no leather. So that's gonna be a little difficult, although we really, really need it. We have a lot of junk. Time to keep digging. Alas, I've run into more coal. We hit more iron on top of a literal load of gravel. Whoa, could have died just then. <laughs> My pickaxe is going to break again very soon. Yep, there it goes. Oh, I just found salt. Huh. What can we use salt for? Oh, lots of different recipes. Okay. I would like to experiment with those. I've never really played around with that mod too much, so I think I am down to get some salt. Plus, you know, I'm pretty salty. Hey, bedrock, we hit the bottom? Found some redstone. Don't know what I would use this for quite yet, but I'm just gonna go ahead and grab it. You never know. Maybe there's diamonds around? Ooh. Well, we hit lava. I think I'm gonna throw some unwanted items in there because we have a lot of them. Oh, with cotton, we can make string. Okay, I'm not throwing that away. All right, well, let's like very carefully look around this lava. This game is called How Many Pickaxes Can Sasha Go Through in One Day? I've hit gold. I actually needed this. I'll tell you why in just a second. There are these wonderful, wonderful things called golden lassos, which allow me to pick up any animal that I see and then just, it'll like just transport it in this little lasso and I can drop it off in my house, which makes it so easy to achieve things. And all I need is some string and some gold nuggets. So yes, hopefully we can achieve this lifelong dream of mine. I have been trying to like tunnel my way back up for so long, I don't know where I am anymore. I don't know what year it is. Whoa, ouchie. Oh, I, I did leave a trail of things. <laughs> I could use some sand anyways. We made it out. I need string. There is a plethora of bad guys around me. I don't know if I'm gonna survive. I don't think I will. I don't have any armor. Ah, just gonna go around. I've made it back to spawn. It is a miracle that I've made it back here alive. I'm gonna start cooking up the rest of this iron and making another chest so I can fit the rest of my junk. I think I am going to try to make some armor. I wonder if there's any other kind of armor. Let's see, there's normal stuff, there's muddy leggings, cloth leggings, hardened leather leggings, leggings of swiftness, multiple kinds, okay? A hunter coat leggings, obsidian leggings of hell? What? It seems like the vampire hunter armor is like the best, but who knows, hopefully I won't need any kind of crazy armor. Just enough so I feel like I'm confident to fight things without uh, always thinking I'm gonna lose. I don't like losing. No. Ooh, I forgot how cool my armor looks on my texture pack. And we will make a helmet. Oh baby, look at me go. Because I'm impatient, I'm just gonna make a second furnace. And put that over here. And we're gonna start cooking up the gold ore that I got. I wonder if I can make that golden lasso. I forgot exactly how many things I need. I need four gold nuggets. I don't think I have four string. I have two. I know cotton makes it, but I don't think I have enough cotton to even make one piece, unfortunately. Maybe, maybe. No, I need three. Oh, three makes two. <gasps> no, that would've been perfect. Alrighty, my gold is done. My iron is done. And I think I am done for today's episode, the very first episode of Harmony Hollow. Don't forget to leave your comments and tell me what kind of house I should build. Should it be crazy? Should it be simple? Let me know what kind of house I should build. I need the help. 
And don't forget to leave any suggestions on what you want to see me do in this SMP. I hope you guys are super excited for this. I know I am, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!